guys welcome back to another video here I got my this 36 Husqvarna hydro walk behind and I've got a few comments about the shoot blockers on these mowers and no I did not buy these shoot blockers they're completely custom made uh, painted to the paint color of the mower and I think the most that uh, this would cost depending on your area uh, whatever your prices are at your local stores um, at most it'd be around fifty dollars if you can handle the welding yourself so basically with this one all it is is a handle up here just a uh, metal rod that's all it is nothing's fancy at all and I found these at Canadian Tire they're just rubber uh, I don't know they bolt on here with clamp and they hold this metal uh, rod perfectly I bent this rod with a blowtorch but it's got no handle but it really doesn't need it uh, and then as we go down here we got another one of those clamps to hold the rod and then this is a swivel socket it's a snap-on swivel socket it's welded here and then it's welded again down here and uh, I guess this is just the way both my mowers turned out but they have this um, bracket already here I didn't make these two brackets this was from a, a regular rubber shoot thing go on here and all it did was put a bolt through here and then welded this piece and this is got this is hollow inside so there's a bolt all the way through it and welded this door onto this uh, round tubing for the bolt to go through and you can't tell it's weld here because it's all grinded down but this all the way open it never falls uh, never falls closed when I'm using it so now you can see the blazer down there there's the handle there all I have to do is close it no problem and I can do it pretty effortlessly so it's uh I don't use it a ton I just I keep the shoot blocker on there so I'm not blowing grass into people's flower beds and whatnot but uh, there's more does really well with mulching leaves and this definitely helps because without this I'd just be blowing the leaves instead of mulching them but uh, we go over to this 60 inch uh, Toro this, this one's a little bit different uh, exact same door it's got a threaded bolt had the exact same uh, brackets on it ready from a, a regular chute that was on there and uh, exact same thing but this one has no handle because I tend to uh, for certain yards if the grass is really tall I'll keep the door open the entire time if the grass is uh, not too long and it's got some leaves on it, one not one mulch up, it's always closed. And uh, all I gotta do is pick it up like this, lay it on the deck. That's it. It's see the blades down there. And uh, oh, these are the best. It's better. I wouldn't say it's better than your grass slap, one not, because the grass slap, you know, you can open it, close it with. Uh, you know your hands being still in the handles but uh, I don't see three hundred dollars for a grass flap being you know all that much better and this especially this one this one didn't even use a handle or anything this one was probably only 25 bucks I think around to make but uh, no it's, it's the best thing so and hopefully I answered your questions Yeah, hopefully you guys liked the video and uh, make sure you comment, subscribe, and leave a like if you like the video. Thanks.